people should really educate themselves on different types of AI used out there. Machine learning is not generative AI. Yeah, I agree, because I was one of those people who needed to be educated. After all, when I saw this headline that PlayStation was going to use AI in their game development, my chest hair started to flare up with anger. But it turns out I was jumping to conclusions. I wasn't educated enough. And I want to make this video to educate you guys and also make sure you don't jump to conclusions either. So as you can see, according to a Sony corporate report, PlayStation wants to incorporate AI and machine learning into their games. But people got upset because the word AI is more demonic than the boogeyman. It's more scary than going to Arizona. But here's the thing. AI is an umbrella term. In other words, there are multiple kinds of AI, similar to, I don't know, the comedy genre having so many subsets to it, like action comedy, drama comedy, horror comedy. And one of those subsets in AI is machine learning, which is the kind of AI that involves continuous learning and collection of data to get better. For example, the subtitles on my videos, that was made by AI, specifically machine learning, because Adobe Premiere Pro has made a software to take my voice and translate it to text very well. Now, the AI people are probably thinking of when they see this is generative AI. You know, the thing that can create new content and is something that is more talked about than climate change killing us. Now, in this context, generative AI is not being used. It's machine learning. And machine learning in future PlayStation games will be used to make things like dubbing and translating video games faster and easier, which is something they did in Spider-Man 2. And that's a good thing for game production because manually inputting subtitles is a task more tedious than waking up and it's more cost efficient and greatly accessible. But obviously jobs will potentially be lost, such as subtitlers and human translators, but that's just to be expected, similar to literal machines starting to do a lot of the manual work humans used to do. So yeah, I just want to clarify that it's really easy to get misled by these kinds of things, but hopefully this confusing topic has been demystified for you guys.